So welcome everybody and happy new year. This is January 1st, 2023. So let's start this new year by um, connecting to oneness, connecting to <clears throat> also uh, my intention this, this evening is really to have us all connecting to oneness and more um, importantly is to connect to the highest version of that oneness, whatever the highest version is for each and every one of us. So let's begin. Let's begin by simply breathing in very slowly and intentionally. So breathe in infinite possibilities. Take in as much as you can. Until you can breathe in no more, then simply let it go slowly. Allow everything that does not support you in this moment to leave. And then breathe in again. Breathing in infinite possibilities. And then let it all go slowly. And whatever it is that does not support you in this moment, let it all go. And breathe in one more time. Just bring in infinite possibilities. And then let it all go. Whatever does not support you in this moment, just let it all go. And continue to follow the rhythm of your own breathing with the intention of elongating your breath as much as it is still comfortable for you. Be kind to your body. Don't try to push your body too much. Just the idea is simply to allow your body to relax with your breath. Each time you breathe in, imagine that you are bringing in infinite possibilities. How much infinite possibilities do you want in 2023? So you can actually bring in that infinite possibilities simply by breathing in. And as you breathe out, whatever does not support you in this moment, simply allow it to leave. If you don't need any more tension in your body, let it go. But if you enjoy tension in your body, then by all means, keep it. It's all up to you. It's your creation, your body. And use your breathing. Use the rhythm of your breathing. to allow your body to get into a karma state. When your body is more relaxed, it is easier for your thoughts to become relaxed as well. And when you feel your body becoming more relaxed, then set the intention that you want to Shift your focus into your heart. And for me, the easiest way to do that, no matter what state I'm in, is to simply imagine that I'm stepping inside this energetic elevator 
that is taking me from my head and allow this energetic elevator to take me as quickly or as slowly as I need to to shift my focus from my head all the way into my heart. And when you have shift your focus into your heart and you tap into that focus, you may feel that as being a slight sensation in your heart. Because wherever your attention is, your energy goes. So that extra bit of energy gives you different sensation in your heart. When your attention is in your heart. Simply focus in your heart. And breathe into your heart. Bringing in infinite possibilities. And as you breathe out, let go of anything and everything that does not support your heart in this moment. And as you shift your attention into your heart, feel that peace and calm. And within your heart, and imagine that you, every time you breathe in, you are breathing in pure love. Pure love of the creator source. We are always connected to the creator source. And every breath we take, we are bringing in pure love of the creator source. It is just that a lot of the times we may have so many thoughts in our mind that may not be supportive of us You're paying attention <coughs> to the quality of the energy that we are bringing in. So let's focus on pure love energy that we are bringing in. And set the intention that that is what we want to focus on to bring more within our body, within our consciousness, pure love. Pure love from the creator source. From the source of our being, from the source of all creations. Let's pay attention to that and let us align ourselves with that, if that is what you wish to do. And let us focus on that part of us that is always connected to the creator source. To the most 
sacred part of our being. That part of us that is beyond space and time. And that part of us that is common to all creations. Because all creations, no matter how big, how small, no matter what vibration it is, whether it is high or low, whether it is natural, or whether it is artificial, all creations exist. Because the will of the creator source allowed it to exist. Let's, let us align with that. And at the same time, Let's also tap into our unique soul signature, even though each and every creation carries a signature of the creator source, but we are all unique. So let us tap into that part of us that is our unique soul signature. And let us allow that the unique soul signature that we each possess as unique as each of our fingerprints. And fingerprints is actually simply a result of our unique soul signature. It is really our body mimicking our uniqueness to let us know that each and every one of us are created as unique creations. No two souls are alike, just like no two persons fingerprints are alike. No two Ours are exactly the same. No two trees are exactly the same. Let us allow that part of us that is unique to guide us. to allow us to look into, to have a preview of what it is or of where it is that our unique soul signature is actually guiding each and every one of us towards and as we tap into both the creator source the oneness within us and also at the same time 
step into that counterpart that makes us all unique within this oneness. And allow us to understand more of the mystery of each and every one of us. And let us align with both. With both streams. With our connection to oneness. And also our connection to our unique soul signature. And allow those to seemingly diverse energies to guide each and every one of us beyond space and time. So that we can create a unique experience unique experience for each and every one of us individually and also each and every one coming together as a collective to experience the totality of our collective creation. And to allow us to tap into that faith that even though we may not know the end result, We may not know where our final destination may be, but we all know and feel that guidance within us that has been put there. Within our heart. Let us tap into that. Tap into our connection to our heart. Tap into our connection to our unique soul signature. And also tap into our connection to the creator source. Not just through our heart, but also through our connection to Mother Earth, to this playground where we are able to create our own vision for our experience in this lifetime and in all lifetimes on Earth. And also to tap into 
the sun. The star of our solar system on Earth. The energy of the sun. is really a representation of the creator source that is within us, within our heart that we cannot see. However, we can see the sun outside. And the sun, the father sky, the radiance of the light outside is our confirmation that as much as the creator is within us, it is also outside of us. And to allow us to understand that what is within is also outside. Every time when we see the sun, when we see Father Sky, when we can feel the warmth of the sun, the light of the sun, let that be a reminder. of our connection to the creator source within our heart. Let's feel that and allow that connection within our heart to grow into faith, into unshakable faith. Let's allow that connection to the creator of all things. That unites all things into oneness. And let us learn that. Learn how to balance oneness and the perspective of our unique soul signature, our both 
different sides of the same coin. They both lead us. to flow with the will of the creator source. Each time we breathe in, allow more of that pure love from the Creator Source to assist us in expanding. Our connection to the Creator Source. and also the connection to our unique soul signature. Our connection to Mother Earth. And our connection to Father Sky. Let us remember to stay in our heart. Let the heart, as a logic that is beyond what our human understanding of logic is. Take another deep breath in, straight into our heart, bringing in as much pure love from the creative source as we can possibly bring in. And when we can breathe in no more than start to let go of your breath. Start to let go of anything and everything that does not support you in this moment. And really allow yourself to come into your body to unite both physical and your non-physical bodies in this moment to come together as one and to float with the will of the creator source in this moment. To 
Take another deep breath in. Try to come into this moment. Feel all parts of you. The parts of you that resides beyond space-time with the creator source and the parts of you that is within space-time in this particular moment, in this particular vessel. And allow yourself as much as you can to experience all of that within your heart in this moment. Take one more deep breath in. Really allow yourself to feel all parts of you coming together in this moment. totality of all of you or of your awareness in focus in this moment And remember that what you feel in this moment is powerful. And that's who you truly are. The powerful creator of your own life and your own experiences. when you can feel that power within yourself and you can take a deep breath in and let it all go and when you're ready you come all the way back into the room and open your eyes when you're ready